Now I know you might be thinking, he has a tractor. Why is he using a shovel? That's because it's just too muddy still. And we're gonna need about a four inch layer of this limestone or maybe even more for the horses. And if I take this tractor on this limestone layer right now, which is only in some places just a dusting or an inch, it's gonna ruin all of my progress. And it just isn't worth it. And hey, I could use a little exercise, so uh, it's all good. Now eventually, the tractor will be going on this. And we'll have our hay hunt here and our hay bales. But like I said, the layer is just too thin right now. And it would ruin any and all progress. Since the whole point of this dry lot is to keep the area not getting muddy, if I dig down into the layer here, it's just gonna be for nothing. So I actually hired uh, a couple guys to work on this. And uh, you know what? They're not really showing up much. I think that's one of the problems with hiring people. Slimes are lazy. That's okay, you know, we'll get it done, we'll get it done. got most of that uh, limestone shoveled one shovel at a time people one shovel at a time so if you remember at the beginning of the video you saw the big pile that's what's left of the pile behind me I still got some work to do with uh, the tractor hauling a little bit might take me an hour or so and then here's what I got for uh, the start of our second dry lot you can see that big pile um, I was able to to push a little bit with the uh, tractor but then the guy working for us is going to be uh, pushing it with his excavator so this is why we need a dry lot because this is what the horses were on before nice and muddy not good for horses Way down there, you might be able to see our horses. They're on uh, their dry lot. Their feet, their hooves are nice and dry, and it's just really good for the winter. So I'm gonna get to work shoveling the rest of this, just one shovel at a time. And uh, we're slowly, slowly getting closer to having the homestead the way we want it. Um, we've been here seven years, and it really is crazy to see how much work we've done in seven years. And uh, that's something to be proud of. So I hope everybody enjoyed this video. If you did, like, subscribe, comment, uh, comment below and tell me what projects you're working on.